Right, another short video. I've reached the gates of the old quarry. Safety alert. Stay out. Stay alive. The quarry's there. That big hill there. That's all part of the quarry that's been carved out. It's very deep. And it talks about some young people that were drowning. On this day, actually that's weird isn't it? On the 1st of June 2018. Fatal accidents involving trespass to water areas by young persons. And it was on this time, look, I'm like, this is the first of June today, isn't that weird? Six years ago, two people were drowned. Two teenagers, Jack and Shay, drowned while swimming in a disused quarry. Didn't say whether it was here, but that's the date there. It's quite likely it could be, couldn't it? You are here. Look at the size of the quarry then. I am here. <sighs> yeah, I've, I've visited this section before when I came out of the path um, just further down there. So I've done the, what I'm doing now, I've done, but the very first part of that from the Blue Ball, from the public road, Spinehead Road, I hadn't walked that section before. But as you can imagine, <sighs> If you want to get back to the bus, it's all downhill. Just remember that. Now, I'm not allowed to check the time until I get to the stone. Even though I stop, I'm stopping en route. So a lot, lot of people park up here and then start their walks. See, so right up through there you're going. You're not far before you're at the stone now. It isn't far. That's what I can remember about it. It wasn't actually far. There's a lot of these big old root areas here. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're nearly there, actually. Yeah. Might not be mine. That could be deceiving. That's not the stone I see. I don't reckon. I don't reckon that's a stone. But when we see the big avenue of trees on the drove, that's one we know. If we see them in a minute, we'll actually know we're very close. Because the Marrow Hills are there. I reckon we've still got to go a little bit further up yet, but don't forget, it's all downhill. Now you imagine if that pub had been open, what a lovely place to stop, to go to the loo, have a drink, before going down that road to get the bus. And it was, it was wide enough to be seen, the big blue ball sign. So, the possibility of me coming back down here is quite, quite great for later. It's due to whether I got time to go to Crocombe and pick the bus up there, walk through the avenue and down that way. That would be nice to do that. I'm not going towards West Bagborough today. When I get to the church, I'm literally going to come in back the way I went today. And I'm leaving that other bit up Stout Lane for another time. Just to be sensible. I expect I'll soon be taking my scarf and coat off everyone. Dear, yeah. Right, and turn off for a bit. I've just walked up there, don't forget. It's all hill climbing around here, lovely big old trees. I imagine this place to get, it's a Saturday. I'm imagining this, where I've just come up now, will be busy with people. So the fact that I got out early is really good. 
you know what I mean? Because they just could be busy. Um, people can come. It doesn't bar people from coming up here. I couldn't see any barred car signs or anything. <sighs> Beautiful trees though, aren't they? Right, I'm going to turn off for a little while, folks. I'll come back on when I've got a bit further up the hill. But all the quarry is just behind there. Triscombe Quarry. Sticks out for miles at a distance, but it is slowly being reclaimed by vegetation. <sighs> It doesn't take long for the ferns and all that to make it their habitat, but there's always signs to warn people, fresh signs. If six years ago those two boys died here, on this day, I find that peculiar as well, that I'm actually out on the 1st of June and just discovered that two boys drowned. <sighs> Right, goodness, look at you. What if I've got to take a picture of you? You're unbelievable. Wait a minute. I've got to take a picture of this one. Aren't you gorgeous? Ah, absolutely gorgeous. I had to take a picture of you. You might see more of me than you think, but I'm probably coming down downhill more, I reckon. I don't know yet. This gives, gives me ch different uh, choices now. Now I've got off at that bus stop. Nice to meet you, old tree. <laughs> There's trees I see all the time in Welbury Wood. Don't know if you can communicate that far. We've got spirit trees over there. Right, Shell, I think you kept the video on for that that bit. Yeah, there's trees in the wood that some people have labelled spirit trees. And I always give them a hug and they pass on some of their energy to me. I'm walking up here for a little bit. It's just a bit softer and kinder on the feet. But we've come from down, right down there and we're still going up. Okay, but it's not the same sort of climb as if you're going up um, Stout Lane. It's still bad though. <laughs> but I've managed to brainwash myself to, to believe in that these hills are good for my heart and lungs. I've brainwashed myself to believe it. Because they make the rib cage move help a spirit get rid of any muck shifts it moves that rib cage it makes it work so you can see like a path going up there as well lots of these little drove paths all right turn off Sheila right, right, folks, just a very quick video because there'll be people around we've got here the last little couple of yards and we're at the stone and the turnings okay I recognise over there going up there to Will, Will's Neck, for example. But there will could be people around now. I just seen two people walking past here. So. We're going to check the time when we get to the stone. Somebody running with a dog. This would be much busier later because it is a Saturday. It's a nice day and people come out with their kids. And they come out with their kids with their bicycles. And lots of people turn up in vans with bicycles. We'll notice more on the way back. I just saw a woman and a dog. And just over there is the Triscombe Stone. And it there it is. Like I said, we've never, we have been up this route before. Saxon armies marched and walked here. There's a lot of history which I've described in other videos. So I'm going to turn off for a minute and just take some photos and then check the time. 
over and out. They're going to be smooth, all joined up though. 